Greetings and welcome, my Alien Magi, to another episode of Let's Play Rise of Legends. Alright, tricky mission. Especially if we don't want to damage Andromelech. Which admittedly is starting to sound like a much better prospect of Queen. But no. Dawn, my mortals. I will not engage in fisticuffs. It's such an ominous thing. Well, it's he doesn't know what he's doing. Well, maybe a few more salamanders will help. Okay, so I've got this nest. It's not currently producing any salamanders, is it? Jeez, man. You don't need that many boxes. Still got one glass cannon. Fine. Right, let's let's reduce his ability to output. Now I'm not gonna kill his cities, but destroying his glass circles. That's a possible. Destroying his mining operation. Definitely a good idea. This is a bad idea. But I can't really attack his eternal flame. Other way. Minus being raided. Well. Circle of Flame. He's probably got another one. He's got two cities after all. Giacomo is in danger? Yes, he is. Let's, uh. Let's get the whole troop moving forward. She's in the go. Um, Belisari, go on and look at this. No, no, no. Stay in the green stuff.
And as long as he's focused on me over here, then he's not raiding my uh, buildings. Isn't that cute? He's sending over miners to mine at this place. All right, let's get over here. Yeah, you're not gonna do much, though. Yeah, actually, stay behind the lines. We'll deal with whatever comes when it comes. Hardly reinforce over here. I mean, I can. I can build a circle of sand, but that doesn't really help. That. to go. Uh, two more buildings to go, but we get the point. Now fight on my side. We have captured a man not fully under the corruption. Ari's magic has helped free his mind. We have convinced him that our cause is the only way to defeat the Dagalin. He has sworn to join us and help free his land. Yeah. Always nice when you get to free somebody from enemy influence. Andromelech, this year is now available for future scenarios. Andromelech, the greatest swordsman of the age, lives in exile. He's unwilling to discuss his reasons. Ooh. Exile of the Alien Kingdom, master of glass magic, allows glass layers to be built. Comes with a free dark walk for each level. Cute. Alright, that province is under attack. Alright, let's first check some safe zones that I can build up. Alright. Now, I mean to attack over in this direction. So I can take uh, the Hellforge Mountains. But first, let's see what research we can build up. Mm, make everything cheaper. It's nice. Let's see. Make them summon faster. 
Well, actually, getting both of these will help me. Because the faster I can get you inside on the field is better, and I like having adult salamanders. So, yay! Right, and so we now also have Andromolek. Let's see. So he's sort of a sniper. That locks down enemies. He's essentially crowd control. And he's already quite well upgraded. Uh, let's focus on uh, getting uh, Ari and perhaps Belisari upgraded first. Well, actually, the Fly Blitz will do. Puritori, no. Might as well give him a point in that. Provided I'll ever summon him, but of course that is still an if. Yeah, I need to get another campaign goal so I can increase my army size. So... Let's go for the Hellforge Mountains. There's not much else I can do with my points, so let's go. Lava Pools. This is a land drenched in flames. Ari tells us that the Fire Guardian, Damanhur, is ward of this region and will not tolerate visitors, no matter their intentions. Despite the lack of welcome, one of the keys they need may well be here. We must convince Damanhur, through force or reason, to allow us access. Ari claims this to be the home of Dominar. But it looks as if the Dark Aline are here as well. We'll have to free her before these monsters take her away. Alright then. I know not the Efreet. Fire scouts. Go explore. Um, we can't allow the Dark Alin to escape with Dominor. And I wasn't intending to. So towards that end. Let's get over there. We're fully outfitted. get as forward as we can. These are dumb and nerf troops. Not really my enemy. But I will fight them if I have to. need loads and loads of uh, heart seekers because the only way they can get her out of here is if they uh, send in a uh, a uh, magic wind which I of course cannot allow Alright, so 
so it looks like that's where I need to get past. Uh, it's probably a little bit too well defended for me alone, though. Let's uh, get a uh, circle. It's our Kalin magic wind. It's headed for Dominor. Destroy it! Right, luckily, it is very slow. to buy this city. That's quite a lot. I would like these troops though. So for now I'll just uh, get some free money. Buy this and get those troops for free. And uh, this oasis increases my border on my uh, pop cap. Which is definitely handy. Enforcements. Let's increase. And since I want to defend against whatever enemies the enemy throws at me. Unfortunately, that would have been convenient. Right, glass circle. Well, the price for this will go down anyway. It's just not quite enough. There's something over there that I might want to investigate first. But I do want to upgrade to a uh, large city. Alright. Nice large army. So I've got some cannon be safe enough to take on whatever is over here. I mean, I'm gonna guess a couple of uh, golems perhaps. You there! If you've come to stake a claim, you're too late. We were here first. I'm not interested in your pitiful little lad. So that's the first of the glass cannons. Jacquemo, the Dark Arlene are coming with a magic wind. We cannot let it take Dominor.
Yeah, I'll finish these teams off, I think. The Fire Citadel dominates this entire area. We will have to capture the Citadel to call forth the Fire Key. But first, we'll need to find a way past this Fire Golem. Well, that looks difficult. We'll deal with that. We'll deal with that next time. Thank you for watching.